Since WordPress is the most popular website building software in the world, powering over 44% of the websites in the entire world, the unfortunate downside is that a lot of hackers try to hack into your website all the time. That's why the security of your website is the first thing you should be focusing on. And in this video, I'm going to tell you the five of the best WordPress security plugins that you should consider for your website. However, you don't need five plugins. I'm going to give you specific use cases where which plugin is more useful. So make a judgment call on which plugin of all of these five plugins is what you should be using on your website. And at the end of the video, I'm going to give you my personal recommendation and also what we use at WP Beginner to secure our very, very large website. So keep watching and I'll tell you at in the end. When it comes to WordPress security, WordFence is the most recognized name. They have a plugin available in the WordPress repository that you can install for free and instantly start securing your website. Once installed, WordFence will add a firewall on your website that will look for malicious users and bots and their actions. Actions like repeated login attempts, attempts at accessing restricted areas of your website and visiting too many pages too fast will trigger the firewall and their activity will be suppressed or they'll be completely banned. You can even add two-factor authentication to your website with WordFence for completely free. Let me know if you want to see a dedicated tutorial around it. If you want to harden your security even further, you can upgrade to one of the premium plans which are quite affordable and offer additional security features and, of course, peace of mind. Next up on our list is Sukri, another highly reputable security plugin and service trusted by thousands of WordPress users. Sukri offers a comprehensive suite of security features to protect your website from threats, which includes a powerful website firewall, malware scanning, malware removal tools, and DDoS protection as well. With Sukri, you can rest assured that your website is constantly monitored for any suspicious activity or vulnerabilities. In the unfortunate event of a security breach, Sukri will instantly notify you, allowing you to take immediate action to safeguard your website and your data. If you upgrade to one of the pro plans, you'll also be eligible for malware removal by Sukri experts themselves, which is great for peace of mind. Make sure to check it out from the link in the description. Next up on our list is iTheme Security, which is another excellent security plugin for WordPress. With over 30 different security measures, iTheme Security focuses on strengthening your website's overall security posture. The plugin provides features like brute force protection, file integrity monitoring, and IP blacklist functionality, which is great. It also offers options to hide sensitive areas of your website from unauthorized access, such as the login page and admin areas. Very useful if you know exactly who's going to log into your website. If you offer the premium version, you'll get access to even more critical security features like password expiration, user activity login, trusted devices, and many other important features. Based on the feature set, iTheme Security is best suited for websites that either have user submissions enabled or have multiple contributors adding content to the site. Make sure to check it out from the link in the description. Next up on the list is All-in-One WP Security. As the name suggests, the All-in-One WP Security plugin is a comprehensive security solution for your WordPress website. It basically checks all the boxes when it comes to security features and offers an easy-to-use interface which you can use to configure your security which can be tough with other plugins. The free version includes features like login security, firewall, file protection, and even content copying protection which is great. And the pro version offers malware scanning, two-factor authentication, and country blocking options amongst other different features. All-in-One WP Security is the most affordable solution out there in terms of pricing and the free version is great to start with for content production and a basic firewall. And if you're really serious about your website security, you should definitely check out and upgrade to the premium version of All-in-One WP Security. The last security service on our list is WP Scan Security, an excellent security plugin specifically designed for enterprise, you can say large website customers. They did have a free offering for a really long time, but their plugin in the WordPress repository clearly now says that they're no longer maintaining the plugin for non-enterprise customers and they recommend another pl plugin themselves. However, the USP of WP Scan is that they use a manually curated vulnerability list to maintain their firewall, which is excellent and I say very, very useful for real-time protection for high-value sites, which is their ideal target market. Since this was a very unique offering and I don't know who's going to be watching this video, I included this on the list as well. But you should note that since they serve mostly enterprise customers, they don't offer a plug and play solution. Instead, you'll have to talk to the sales team and have a custom solution created and deployed with their API for your website. But if you're building a very large business or if you're a large publisher already, WP Scan security offering is something you should definitely consider. 
All right, that's the five plugins you should be looking out for when you want to secure your WordPress website. Time for personal recommendations. So my personal recommendations, which I use on my website is the WordFence plugin. It's a fantastic plugin and I find it very, very useful. And at WBeginner, Beginner, we use the Sukri plugin or Sukri plugin to uh, protect our really, really large website. So those are the five security plugins. Which one is the one that you're going to use on your website? Let me know in the comments. And if you have any questions, you can use the comments as well. You're watching WBeginner. Beginner. I'm Yuvraj. Hope you like, share and subscribe this video. I'm going to catch you in the next one. Take care.